What is up everyone and welcome back to more Attack on Titan! In the last episode we got a bit more of a backstory into the corruption in the world and let's be honest here, we all seen that coming. Nothing is ever this fantasy story that you think it is that everybody wants to join up into their kind of an army and then everybody is basically gonna fight the titans, look after the other people, no 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 no. Most of the people literally want to serve under the king so that they can have their three meals a day, never see a titan in their life and just live this kushti way of life. And our boy Eren is not like that whatsoever. If anything, he's very motivated by revenge to avenge his mother. I gotta say, like, I would probably be the same. I don't think I would ever be one of these people that just wanted to live out my life, like, living in fear, doing nothing about this terrible situation. I feel like I would want to better myself so that I could look after everybody and make a change in the world. I'm definitely one of those kind of people. So me and Erin... Peace out, mother trucker. Peace out. The Titan, of course, has decided to appear at the end of the last episode, just when we were getting ready to have some meat, which we kindly stole from the higher-ups, but that's okay. They don't need all of that. We need it, okay? We're the soldiers. I understand. Don't forget, if you want to watch the Patreon-style version of this video, to head on over to my website, suzilu.co.uk, and become a V. IP member. And also don't forget to smash that subscribe button as well if you are watching this on YouTubes. All right, let's do this. In the year 850, mankind didn't start this fight, but we're gonna finish it. Mountain cannons blood full! Take out the colossal type! This is our chance! Don't let it slip away! <laughs> you It's been a whole five years, honey, and we coming to kill you! Here we go! We're gonna kick your ass! Probably. Like, what is this guy's problem? He just comes in and cracks everything! Nice butt, though. Bitch! He took out the cannons! Yeah, with like one swoop! He... he planned it! He has intelligence! I was gonna say, the fact that he puts that perfect hole there of the perfect size... I gotta take him down! Come on, Aaron! He's so small on the Titan! Damn it! Take that! Oh? Oh no. Oh no! Come on! Fight back! Fight back! Ah! Huh? Where'd he go? What the? Did he just vanish into thin air? What the hell? He comes in like a lightning bolt and then vanishes like a ghost? Exactly like five years ago! He's here one moment and gone the next! Just like that! Yeah, but he's left a massive hole and everyone can start coming in! In case you hadn't noticed, there's a breach. We have to act now! If they start pouring in, that's it! Look alive! <laughs> Operation Colossal Titan response is in effect. I expect you to take part. Report to HQ. If you got close to the damn thing, we need details. Sir! Sir, we pray the advanced team will be victorious! I mean, the only intel we have is he comes in like a wrecking ball and then pisses off just as quickly! Hair down! Take only what you need to survive! File through as calmly as possible! God, it's literally five years ago again, all over! If they get through, we'll have a repeat of five years ago! Consider this the last line of defense! The Titans get held off here, or nowhere! Wait, are they actually coming though? Fire! Oh my god, they are! So he paves the way so that the little titans can get food. That son of a bitch, we're not food! I promise we'll get through this. You're safe as long as I'm beside you. Oh no, don't say that, because you're making me feel like you guys ain't gonna survive. There's a hole in the wall eight meters wide and we don't even remotely have the engineering know-how to plug it. 
That huge boulder near the front gate was our best bet. But we couldn't figure out how to hoist it in place. I was gonna say though, surely you learned something in the past five years because they made the exact same hole before. Think about it. Anytime the moon strikes them, they can wipe out the human race in an afternoon. Armin! Listen to me. You're focused on the past. Look ahead. We're not gonna be the victims anymore. You're a scout now, buddy, so come on, slap him. You got this. Oh, God, I hate them. They're coming in. There is no one there, you guys. There's no one there. Um, okay. It's clearly my brain is inferior to yours, Lord Vault. <laughs> so let me get this straight. All the commoners live in fear and you get to have cookies, play chess, and have people looking after you, and you have a giant moat around where you stay. I beg your pardon, young man. The this Colossal private... Titan has laid siege to the city of Trost. Reports say the gate has been destroyed. You're gonna do something, right? You ain't just gonna sit there. Where are you going? Pixis, wait! You can't just march off! I command you to stay! Preparations must be made! Assemble your troops and establish a garrison around my estate this instant! What did he just nab and put in his jacket? Untold numbers of our brave comrades in arms are laying down their lives in defense of trust as we speak. Commander, I'll go ready the horses, sir. When the dust has settled, there may well be more graves than people to dig them. An astronomical number of lives snuffed out in a twinkling. Yes, well, no help for it, is there? If it's their time. What? Besides, what? No, you don't believe that. You don't believe that. You selfish fat shit. I wish you another opulently appointed day of sloth and tranquility. Are you kidding me? As if you live in a world of tranquility. Oh, I, I don't like him. Mm-mm. I expect you all to man your post, knowing the advance team has been wiped out. <gasps> That's right. The outer gate is history. The Titans are in. This means the armor Titan is I'm scared. I feel like we're going to start losing characters very quickly. Right. Those in the vanguard be ready. The whole area is well nigh saturated. Your mission is a very simple one. Defend the wall till the evacuation's done. Now! You mean sacrifice ourselves until the evacuation is done, right? Lay down your lives! Dismiss! Sir! God, it just feels like so many of them are just too young for this. They've not even lived their lives yet. <laughs> like, they're not ready for this! They, like, just finished their training or whatever, but... <coughs> Ready. Move it. What the hell, man? What's wrong with you? What kind of question is that? We're all about to be Titan, Chow. You expect me to sing you a happy little song? You're loving this, aren't you, you little psycho? Of course you are. Your whole life's aspiration is to be eaten. Oh my god. His whole life he wants to change the world for the better, you doofus. You are trained for this. What do you think the last three years were about? We survived. We stared death in the face and we lived. Not everyone can say that, can they? Some people couldn't take it and either ran or were thrown out. Hell, some people actually died, but not us. Am I right? We powered through for three years. What's one more day? You can do this, Jean, all right? The MP will still be waiting for you tomorrow. Nice speech. I feel like that's what they need right about now, whether he accepts it. I'm so nervous for all of them. This is gonna get ugly, and when it does, the plan goes out the window. Come and find me so I can protect you. Who the hell do you think you Ackerman, are? You're with uh, me. You've been assigned to the rear guard on special orders. Let's get moving. But sir, I'm a cadet. I'll slow everyone down. What? You're not being asked for a self-evaluation here. The mass exodus is falling apart. We need as many elite soldiers as possible to get things back on track. Sir, with all due- hey! <laughs> You've been given a direct order. Can you come this shit down? Aaron, seriously, like you're being kind of mean. Why are you shouting at her? I'm sorry, this whole situation just has me out of my head. Just promise.
Thomas, promise me one thing. Whatever happens, don't get yourself killed. Did you seriously just do that? Allow myself to get killed. Oh my god, dude. Like, you need to learn that the people around you are your friends, if not family. And you need to learn to treat them with some freaking respect. Whether Titans possess human-like intelligence is up for debate, of course. And to date, there have been no reports of high-level communication between them. We do know that Titan physiology is fundamentally different than most organic life. As they lack reproductive organs, it's unclear how they reproduce. Apart from this, to all appearances, their physique resembles the average human male. Oh my god, that's the point, isn't it? How do they reproduce when they don't have the PP or the VV? Given that they've subsisted for over a century without access to their only source of nourishment, however, we surmise that these creatures do not, in fact, consume us to live. Let that sink in. Titans aren't motivated by hunger as such. They're simply in it for the kill. Oh, shoot. So they kill for fun or some other reason? Even with their heads blown to bits, the Titans persist. Though there is some variability on this score, a Titan's head usually regenerates within two minutes. Is that true? No way! What the hell? So how do you kill them? There is, in fact, one way to ensure death. Strike here. If the back of their neck takes adequate damage, a Titan will not regenerate. This is the chink in the proverbial arm. Okay, so that's why they're always teaching them to take the cut at the back of the neck. Look at it this way, Armin. It's a golden opportunity. I mean, if we prove our worth as soldiers right here, we'll rise up right through the ranks. Before long, we could even be leading our own regiment. We could bypass rookie status altogether. <laughs> Is that really what's important to you, though? I thought it was more about just saving everyone. Who cares about ranking? Listen up. Whoever kills the most titans gets bragging rights. <laughs> Better not fudge your scores. Squadron 34, move out! The Vanguard needs support! Well, at least they can have, like, a little bit of a sense of humor while doing this. I feel like you need that bit of motivation to be like, all right, let's go see who can kill the most amount of titans. Long as the big guy don't come back. I'm worried about Armin, though. There's so many of them! That's okay, all we need is one swoop for the back of the neck. We've got an abnormal! Hold up! He just like flew! What the hell? They don't just walk around like creepy things. No! Oh God, please help me. Oh my God!
Like, they've literally taken Eren's freaking leg and they've eaten Armin. For that. Trust me, you'd change your mind if you knew what was actually out there. For example, according to this like, book... Are these not the main characters? Are they not supposed to survive? But my parents are... Well, they're going to sneak outside the walls to see for themselves. They'll know what it's like firsthand. We should do it ourselves one day. No, this is... This is just terrible! <laughs> no! Oh my god, come on! Don't let go, don't let go, don't let go, don't let go! Oh my god! I refuse to die like Come on, get him out of there! The things you told me about... I have to see them. should literally just be what I don't understand like <laughs> I uh wow holy crap that was insane so I, I just, I have to go and watch the next episode. Like, what the hell just happened? I, wow. Okay, cool. Just kill off everyone in the fourth episode and that's the end of Attack on Titan, everybody. Wow. Okay, I will catch you guys in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye. <laughs>